Okay, I want to uh, take a few minutes now to go back through all the classes that we have accomplished so far in the John David Ebert School for the Study of Culture, Cosmology, and the Arts. We started uh, back in April of last year, and these are all the classes, and so I just want to highlight that these completed classes are available for a purchase uh, that runs anywhere, depending on the class, from $100 to $150. Um, and you would contact me at my email for these, johndavidebert at gmail.com. And uh, so we started with this first class, Transformations of Consciousness Through Time, A Journey Through the Cosmos. And we went through um, Rudolf Steiner and then Sri Aurobindo, Gene Gebser and the Ever-Present Origin, Eric Neumann and his Origins and History of Consciousness, Ter de Chardin and the Christification of Consciousness, Arthur Young and the Reflexive Universe, and then a conclusion on the axial age. So this course includes, uh, I believe it is um, a video lecture for each one of these, as well as a classroom discussion. So the $150, you would end up purchasing about, I think, 16 or possibly 15 videos. I think the last one is missing the class discussion, but it would be 15 videos. Um, and those are obtainable through my email. I can email them to you if you are interested in taking the class. Now, this next one on the psychology of Carl Jung, I did for a different school, and it does not contain the classroom discussions with it. Uh, so its price is only $100. And this is just an odyssey through the imagination of Carl Jung. Uh, and we here it's just eight video lectures of me lecturing on Jung with an, uh, a biographical introduction, Jung versus Freud, his theory of psychological types, the archetypes of the collective unconscious, uh, the differences that, as he sees them between men and women, uh, the semiotics of alchemy, the idea of synchronicity, and finally his book, Answer to Job. So that one is just eight videos for $100. And then we moved on to a much larger course. I think the, the longest one up to this point, I think it's nine classes, nine for the nine muses. Understanding Mythology, A Hymn to the Muses. Um, and so here what we did, here we have the introduction, which was, uh, and each of the muses I've, I've put just for fun, the, the nine muses here, which is why this one has nine classes. So this one will contain nine discussions as well as, um, I believe it's eight video lectures. One of, one of them is missing one of the video lectures, I think, uh, at the end. The Function of Mythology, the Freud-Jung Conflict, the Archetypes of the Collective Unconscious, uh, Joseph Campbell, Part 1 on the Hero's Journey, Part 2 on the Masks of God, William Merwin Thompson and the Imagination of History, and then my book, Rage in the Word, about Gilgamesh, Ignatan, and Moses, and then Mary Setagast on Atlantis, Zarathustra, and Plato, and then Maria Gimbutas and the Civilization of the Goddess, and then finally her student, uh, J.P. Mallory, in search of the Indo-Europeans. All right, and then so we moved on, and we did the history of German idealist philosophy, and we went through um, eight classes here, so this one should contain eight discussions classroom discussions, as well as eight videos. Uh, introduction to the Rationalist versus the Empiricist, Kant's Critique of Pure Reason, uh, Fichte's Science of Knowledge, Schelling's First Outline of His System of the Philosophy of Nature, Hegel's Phenomenology of the Spirit, Schelling's Ages of the World and Philosophical Investigations into the Nature of Human Freedom, Schopenhauer and the Fourfold Root of the Principle of Sufficient Reason, and finally his book, World as Will and Representation. Uh, these 16 videos are uh, uh, definitely worth $150. You will get every cent worthwhile out of this. It, it, it's definitely worth it. We, we had a grand time going through all those guys. Uh, and then we did a, a class specifically on the philosophy of Friedrich Nietzsche, a guided tour through seven of his best books. Um, this one's eight classes. Also, eight, eight classes, eight videos. Introduction to the Life and Works of Nietzsche, uh, The Birth of Tragedy, Thus Spake Zarathustra, Beyond Good and Evil, on the Genealogy of Morals, Twilight of the Idols, the Antichrist, and Ecce Homo. So this should be a total of 16 videos altogether, $150. Same thing here for the Philosophy, Mythology, and Cosmology of Rudolf Steiner, my all-time favorite German mystic. Um, and here we do all the basic ideas of Steiner with an introduction. We went through and read Theosophy, How to Know Higher Worlds, Cosmic Memory, The Principle of Spiritual Economy, the Fifth Gospel, his ideas about karmic relationships, and the dawning of the age of the Archangel Michael. And then so after that, uh, I gave a free class on mythology and the movies. Uh, but if you want all the videos that we did from this, um, 
they're all still available and uh, that they're all just cl the classroom discussions in this case. So it would be eight classroom discussions and that one, if you wanted them, would be $100. Introduction to Myths and Movies, 2001 A Space Odyssey. And in each one of these cases, we uh, followed my scene by scene books, uh, except for 2001 A Space Odyssey, I didn't finish it, uh, but I wrote half the book. So uh, I, I posted the half of the book on the site. And then, but we, we did read my Star Wars scene by scene, Apocalypse Now scene by scene, The Shining scene by scene, Alien scene by scene, Blade Runner scene by scene, and Videodrome scene by scene. This was probably almost the funnest class I think that we ever did. And we're gonna do another one soon. And then we went through and read Thomas Mann's great novel, The Magic Mountain, uh, his great 1924 novel. And see here we went through, uh, in this case, uh, with when we start reading novels, um, it's redundant to do a video lecture before the class since I end up lecturing for about a half an hour at the beginning of each class anyway. So in this case, it would be an introductory video class and classroom discussion, which would make this one nine videos total. Uh, and then so we just went through all the, the seven chapters. So that one, or rather seven, uh, so total, total of eight videos. I forgot that we ended with uh, chapter seven, which is the, the book is divided into chapter seven, seven chapters for the, the cosmic number seven. And then we uh, went through philosophies and mythologies of world history. And we talked about uh, in the first class, the introduction to the philosophy of history, India versus Zoroastrianism. So we contrasted the great Indian Meha Yugas with the, Zoro, the Zoroastrian single shot arch of history. Then we discussed clocks, calendars, and Joachim of Fiore in his three ages, the age of the Father, the age of the Son, and the age of the Holy Spirit, Vico's new science, Hegel's philosophy of history, Oswald Spengler's Twilight of the Evening Lands, i.e. Decline of the West, Arnold Toynbee in the study of history, and we finished with Carol Quigley and the evolution of civilizations. Um, and then so we are still working on this one, Understanding James Joyce, although this first book is completed, A Portrait of the Artist as a Young Man. So we read through that. Here's all the chapters for it. This one's only $100. And then um, we moved on to Evolution of Media Studies, where we went through uh, an introduction, and then Harold Innes, who was more or less the founder, just slightly ahead of McLuhan. Then Mar two classes on Marshall McLuhan, Walter Ong's Orality and Literacy, Willem Flusser, Into the Universe of Technical Images, Neil Postman, uh, his book Amusing Us to Death, Leonard Schlein's book The Alphabet Versus the Goddess, and then we finished with my book, The New Media Invasion. And then, so we just recently completed the second Joyce class on Understanding James Joyce Ulysses, we will be doing Understanding James Joyce 3, Finnegan's Wake, believe it or not, uh, later in the year. And here are the chapters um, and the videos. And then, uh, let's see. Currently, right now, this class is ongoing. Uh, we're only on the second class of Gene Gepser and the Ever-Present Origin, chapter by chapter. So we're just reading the book now through chapter by chapter. And um, or we're about to start the third uh, class for this. Um, it's still only $150 if you want to participate or if you just want to subscribe. And we can, I can send the, um, the video lectures to you and classroom discussions to you each week through your email. And we have just started on Tomas Mann's epic tetralogy, Joseph and His Brothers. One of the most underrated novels of the 20th century. It is an absolute masterpiece. Uh, we have done the first class for this and the second class will be next week. And we are having a great time with this one. Now, upcoming, starting on Thursday night, uh, uh, Thursday night, October 12th, we're going to do a new movie class, uh, Josh Hicks and I, Thursday night movie night with John David Ebert and Josh Hicks, and it's at 6 p.m. MST uh, every Thursday night thereafter, um, after October 12th. And then so we're starting with Monsters, of course, because it's uh, the Halloween month. First, we'll discuss on October 12th the original 1933 King Kong uh, the following Thursday, Frankenstein, the original James Whale, and then Godzilla, the original Godzilla, 1954, uh, Ishiro Honda's version, Gojira, which is still the best one ever made. And then after that, we will be doing The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad, and then after that, uh, Jason and the Argonauts, and then after that, The Golden Voyage of Sinbad. All three of those films are will be analyses of uh, the artistry of the great, the world's greatest animator ever. Uh, Ray Harryhausen. Okay, so that's the school hitherto. All this stuff is available through me, at, as I say, at my email, johndavidebert at gmail.com. 
All right, then. Um, I also still do astrology readings for anyone interested in that. Also hit up my the, the same email uh, address. All right, I'll see you in class.